Today we're going to talk about Feynman diagrams. Feynman diagrams were invented by Feynman. Feynman diagrams are very important tools in particle physics. He was a great scientist. He got Nobel Prize for QED. D means quantum electrodynamics. These are called force carriers and they're called bosons. These are uh, matter particles and they're called fermions. These are bosons. This is photon, this is gluon, this is Z, and this is W plus minus. We have six quarks up, down, charm, strange, top, bottom. We have six leptons. Electron, meon, tau, neutrinos. All these particles get mass by interacting with Higgs boson. Feynman diagrams explain how these particles interact with each other. In Feynman diagrams, time goes this way and space goes this way. Now we'll see electron-electron interaction. When two electrons go close, This electron emits photon and goes this direction. Other electron absorbs photon and goes this direction. That's how electrons ripple. When electron and positron collide, they become photon and photon becomes electron and positron again. Einstein E equal to M C square. Matter becomes energy, energy becomes matter. If you have more energy, then you can make neon plus and neon minus. If you have even more energy, then you can make quarks. Neutron becomes proton plus electron plus anti-neutrino. Neutron is made of up, down, down quarks. Proton is made of up, down up quarks. This is neutron. Neutron becomes proton and W minus boson. W minus boson becomes electron. This is electron and this is anti-neutrino.